It's Pokemon Community Day. It actually started about half an hour ago, so we're a bit late today, but still plenty of time. It's a married day today, so all the, all, all, most of the Pokemon that spawn will be sheep, which is fun. And then if we manage to evolve one of them to the maximum level uh, before 1 p.m. this afternoon, it'll get some crazy additional. Wow, look at these beautiful little majestic bastards who's got no hair. Oh, there he is. Hello. What you doing? Hello, what you doing down there? Yeah. Anyway, I was saying yes, it'll get some crazy like electric move or something, I'm not quite sure what it is, but still worth doing. Plus, hopefully, when we go to the, the park around the corner, there should be a lot of people there. We're not going just this time, we don't typically do go to a big city, because there's loads of stops and loads of people there playing I mean, the gyms and the raids and the attacks and stuff. This time we, we're not doing that, because we've got a lot of stuff to do in the afternoon, which isn't near a city, which is a shame. But, I'm hoping there'll still be plenty of people at the park, because there's a lot of stops there, and it's quite a popular park too, so we should still see some action, hopefully. Plus it's a nice day too, so I mean it's a little more chilly and a bit more grey than yesterday was, but it's still pretty decent. It's not raining yet, so touch wood. It'll stay that way. <laughs> Look at that car, how weird shaped it is. Those wheels are so near the front of its car. Must have an amazing turning circle. <laughs> that looks, looks so weird. The wheels are further ahead than the number plate is. <laughs> But before we go hard on Pokemon, it's time for some breakfast. Oh. I don't know what that is, but it's amazing. I love that just around the corner of this like roundabout, there's like an abandoned ship in the canal. It's so cool. It's also a Pokemon gym, which helps. You can like, hardly see it, unfortunately, but it's got like a cool steamboat thing on the back too. It's so good. Okay, that's a better look at it there. You can see kind of through the trees there. I don't know if it was like put there deliberately or if it like got marooned or washed up or something. I have no idea about the backstory, but I do think it's freaking cool. Ah, oh, there we go. Finally got a good view of it through a crazy fence, but that is what the shipwreck is. I don't know anything about it, but I absolutely love it. I think it's incredible. Ticks all my boxes anyway. <laughs> I love this part too. I guess it's like a mini waterfall, but I don't even know how it exists. There must be a reason for it, right? Why would they put this in? But. Whatever it is, I think it's awesome. Everywhere you look, people are playing it. Like, there's gangs of people just playing Pokemon, walking around with their phones. It's so good. Definitely playing Pokemon. But of course, it's raining. Knew the sun wouldn't last that long. Scooter City! Hundreds of them just turned past. <laughs> Land tailoring. Tailor your local area network with some plants of some sort. It's back! Look! Thought it was an Impreza. Says it right on the front of the window. Definitely Impreza. Cool wheels, though. Although I'm not sure those brake fads are only going to be much use for much longer. And I like inside the grill. That looks really mean. So, I have actually spent the last hour or so playing Minecraft on my phone. Which is a bit unlike me, I've not done that for a very long time. But Josie had a little nap on the sofa and I just sat next to her and killed some time and it was good. I, I hope I can go back to it every now and then, just like whenever I've got 10 minutes to kill and start, just build a couple of things, I'm in creative mode. So I'm hoping I can just sort of like, gradually, slowly, a little bit at a time, um, build up some big world. I think that'll be quite fun, just in my own free time. And then maybe, has occurred by the way, because you wondered, and maybe in the future I'll uh, have something worth showing off. But for now, we are heading over to Josie's uh, sister's place, where the six-year-old lad uh, is going to get given a toy Minecraft Lego thing. She's over in her car because as soon as we've done over there, we're gonna head over to my place and she's got wobbly as hell. She's gonna take her car so that she can go to work if she needs to and I can take mine so I can go to work if I need to. Holy crap, it's wet. Oh my God, we just like, just left the house after seeing, I dropped off presents and played a, bit of, played a bit of mobile Minecraft again with him so that was fun, but we just left now and oh my God, it is, it is wet. I mean, this is, at this point, we're basically underwater. This is, Horrendous. Like, so scary, actually. I put my lights on, really. The car hasn't realized that it's this dark because, I mean, yeah. Anyway, I need to try and, uh, well, I'll turn my podcast on because I've got that save ready to go. Just one tap and that's playing. So I'm going to get a good podcast on and settle in for the drive. I've got 83 miles range because I've been tottling around the, the, the town all day today playing Pokemon, so that was good. But the fact that I've lost like maybe 10% charge and still in the 80s. Uh, for miles ranges is, is very good news for me. 
about 10 degrees and chucking down the rain. This is this is UK for you, isn't it? At its finest, really. But short drive home. Josie is like behind me in her car, so we'll get. Well, she'll probably, she'll probably beat me home tonight. Her car goes faster than mine. I I drive nice and steady to try and get more out of my battery, whereas her fossil engine down there, she'll storm ahead of me, I'm sure. But heading home anyway, and I will see you shortly. So tonight I fully intended to be watching uh, Justice League because it is the next one in our series of Batman movies. Until I was very quite rightly pointed out that it's actually not. I completely forgot Batman vs Superman was a thing. We actually started watching the beginning of Justice League and it starts off with like an interview with Superman and then there's papers saying Superman's dead and stuff and I'm like, wait a minute, what? Then I saw a comment from yesterday's vlog, or on yesterday's vlog, from Megatech, saying that Batman vs Superman was a thing and that it's a prequel. I was like, okay. Yeah, that's that's definitely next. So we're halfway through that now, and uh, I'm actually quite enjoying it. I fully thought it would be hot garbage, but it's not. I'm actually quite enjoying it. It's pretty decent so far. Just have a quick pause to get some chocolate, because there's still a fair whack of it left over from Easter. And uh, to put some more um, towels and things in the wash so that I can actually shower tonight, ready for work tomorrow morning. And when I say Easter chocolate, I of course mean a chocolate hashtag. I don't, I don't even know, but... Should be good. So my cat, the lovable fluffball, is down there. You can see her through the darkness, see her eyes shining in the light night. But over there is another fluffball staring, always watching. Or Batman. I feel like I must have missed something in this movie. Cause I don't know what's going on, really. That was a very weird movie. I I'm, I'm really not sure what I thought about that at all, to be honest. It started off quite well. First half of the movie I really quite enjoyed. Um, I liked the Batman parts of it. Batman was, yeah, he's a good Batman. I enjoyed that. I liked the world that it built with his, his bat lair or whatever, the bat cave. It was pretty cool, very good. Didn't much like Alfred. I thought he was a bit of a strange character to have in that. He, he was too, the guy in the chair kind of moment rather than just the butler. And then it got to the end and it all went weird. Like, I, I don't understand where the spaceship came from, like the one that was in the middle of Metropolis. Like, what's what's that about? Did I miss when that crashed? Is that a different movie? Have I, I missed that? And the thing that came out of the spaceship, what was that about? And then Wonder Woman just turned out of nowhere? Like, okay, okay, okay. And then Batman didn't really do anything in the whole movie. Like, he, he, he could have just not been there, really. All he contributed was he made the spear at the end, which he didn't even use. Superman did and killed himself doing it. Or killed himself. Sorry, spoilers for the movie. You've not seen it, by the way. But yeah, I, I don't really know how I felt about that. I'm glad I saw it. Uh, I know I'm definitely going to watch Justice League, the next one. But very strange film. And it was three hours long. Three hours! I had no idea. I'm so tired. Anyway, I need to end the vlog off here for today. Hope you have enjoyed. If you have, a like rating is always very, very, very appreciated. But otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow at 7pm for the next daily vlog. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all later.